Hello everyone, welcome back to Alcatraz Plays Bendy and the Ink Machine. I was going to stop, <laughs> but in fact, I, I'm not been given the option. Cannot. Won't let me. Um, because it's very scary. There's been a toilet here all this time. Stars. Look inside, you'll need this. Again, the pipe. Oh, that's what you asked for. What does this say? You draw beautifully. What else? There's so much stuff. She, will, she did leave me for dead. Well, she didn't leave me for dead dead. I like the fact there's a coffin where I've been sleeping. Take the spoon. Add the vault. Uh, now what? I guess I just break this down, right? I can't go this way because that's where Bendy will be. I guess we go this way, which is where everybody else went. He didn't even show up. What a lame, lame Bendy he turned out to be. Follow me. I did appreciate that she had an angel, uh, like a halo, which obviously she will never have seen uh, because she would have had to look through the thing into a mirror. Very interesting. Uh, this new Boris doesn't like us. Previous Boris got turned into gross by the bad Alice. That was weird. Oh yeah, I'm just being quiet whilst I figure things out. Um, bad Alice turned old Boris into a bunch of goop. Well, a very well-armoured bunch of goop, but a bunch of goop nevertheless. And, um, I remember talking about when we first encountered Alice that I wasn't sure about the way the creatures were made out of ink, which was an astute observation because, of course, now we have a second Alice who is not corrupt, or at least is not insane, <laughs> but she doesn't seem to be the person launch the barge that was, uh, you know, angry and jealous of the original person. Okay. Uh, of the of her replacement, I should say. That's what I remember. There was a replacement type thing going on. She wasn't happy with it <laughs> at all. How do we get in it? I'd like to get in it, please. Right, I guess I can just climb in. Oh, oh it's just two steps. Fine. <laughs> fine, fine. We stop. I'd like to get in. Thank you. Um, so now, the question is, first of all, can I, um, and then the other question is, what personality is this new Alice, I guess? Stopped. You have to hold it. I don't like that very much at all. I guess you do have to hold it. And it takes a while to stop. To go where I look, or is it just going on its own? I think it's just going on its own. Uh oh. This game gets weirder and weirder. I do have one criticism. It's this is this is a very petty Sounds thing. Like something stuck in the paddle wheel. Um. Hello. I don't like this. The maybe it's because it's a fairly new game. It's not not a new game, but like a, an indie game. But some of the animations and stuff feel quite amateurish. Um, which oh, got got. <laughs> what do you want me to do? Um, which is fine. You know the the. Aesthetic of the game is not affected by the, the sort of pantomime nature of the. Oh, I do get set back quite a long way this way. This time is punishment for getting caught. Don't know what caught me, so that's a bit of a shame. Um, but yeah, this is some weird pantomime nature, which you get. I mean, you get it in very professional games. So I'm not actually complaining. I'm hoping that just that little sousong of extra production value for the next game would. I think it's going to make a massive difference, and then. Um, this is called Chapter 5, The Final Reel, but I'm not sure 
Um, so that means this is the final chapter. Now something got me. I'll go backwards. Well, okay. I don't need to do that bit again, so at least there's that. Um, they did set me back a bit. And it says, she said, don't let the ink touch you too much, it'll claim you, and you've been wading around in the ink, which doesn't seem like the sort of thing that this game would miss. Do you know what I mean? Um, the, the only criticism of any type I have for this game is in the animations and the, maybe a, a tad of the voice acting, but who, who cares about voice acting? All, all games have terrible voice acting, it's just normal. Um, and it's a lot better than many games have been so far that I've ever played, so um, I'm really not complaining about that. But it doesn't miss things like, don't touch the ink, it's going to claim you, whilst also having made you wander around in the ink for donkey's years. And this bendy hand that's following me around right now is a little bit worrying as well. We haven't really got any um, indication of what the ink is actually is, you know? I mean? No saying. So... There's, there's stuff going on that we're not privy to, and it's not really, there's not enough exposure, not enough expose for us to be able to really work it out. Basically, if you're too slow on this, <laughs> the hand catches you, that's what happens before. <coughs> Can you just stop clogging up with ink? <laughs> Is that too much to ask? Because the hand gets closer each time, and it's very worrying. Ah! And your loser with the pipe can't just smack three times in a row. He has to pause in between each one, which is very silly. Indeed. Um, help. Hello, fishing person. I'm really not terrified by these um, ink people. I'm guessing that they're just previous employees that have been claimed by the ink. They seem to re have retained some of their, you know, Self, I guess. So, they're just benign, normal, not unfriendly, not scary characters. Well, I'm not going that way. Very go forward sort of game, isn't it? Down here, we're all sinners. What what real words are there? What actually important? Words? Notice there's a lot of this fuzz in the air. Let me see through this strange glass, which is lit up in a sense that makes me wonder if um, it's got something to do with like a dressing room sort of thing. Oh, yeah. Alice's character wants people now fall into this. Um, might have been the sort of the glamour actress sort of stereotypical 20s Hollywood style thing. But I'm not really sure what the dressing room lights thing would have to do with an animation studio. So <laughs> I'm guessing it's not that. Oh shit. Ah, uh, okay. He didn't stop. <laughs> he would not let me go. That was not fair. I was talking about loose ends. I was trying to talk about loose ends at the end of the last episode, thinking that we were getting close to the conclusion. But of course, I was thinking we haven't seen this Joker since. Um, the last. What? Well, since the one time that we did see him. I'm not quite sure how to approach this fight. So. I guess you wallop him and then run away whilst he does this thingy thing. Lies. Lies. A bit like this. <laughs> Keep running until your health comes back. I guess that's the trick here. Run until your health comes back. And hit him again. 
Ow. <laughs> I can't hear him at all. That's annoying. Um, yeah, I was surprised to see this Joker again. But I'm pleased to because. No! Don't look at me! Stay away! That light may be. Uh... Anything special? He just sort of been forgotten, but here he is again, so that's cool. Go in here. The noise hasn't stopped. <laughs> Be grateful if the scary music would go away. Because we're not in combat anymore. Hmm. This open? Obviously, this opens. How do you make it open? Have your axe, please. I had nothing. Well, I'm going to free you now. Free your head right off your shoulders. Sheep, sheep, sheep. It's time for it's Boris. Time for sleep. <laughs> Just in time for the Boris. Who's called Tom. Thank you. Please don't hurt me. You're a bro. Thanks, bro. Was close. Hi. You're lucky we were in the neighborhood. Nothing special about you, but you are definitely. Was that him? I don't know. I don't think so. You're definitely the got a halo. Lost ones built this make place. you a, a, an angel. Sammy must have been keeping them at bay. Now that he's gone, though. looks like we're in for a fight. Get ready. Watch out! Here they come. Wow, these ones are tougher than the other ones. Ah, maybe headshots count. That would make sense. Hey! The ones with faces are getting me. It's not fair. I thought they were friendly. Alright, just keep hitting them. What? It hurt me. I mean, do I need to do anything? <laughs> Won't they just win for me? Get away from me? Do I have to do something? I feel like it's the sort of thing where you get punished if you don't actually help at the same time. It doesn't seem to be happening. Maybe one of those can die. Can do this. Keep fighting. Ow. Uh-oh. Run. Hide. Whoa, leave me alone. What is this? Why have you got pumpkins? Oh, you've got a helmet. That makes sense. <laughs> pumpkins where your head should be. Oh, why am I? Not helmets. No, why would they be helmets? It doesn't make any sense. I've already seen helmets in this game, and yeah, I still do. Put two in. Oh. Enough of this. It could at least be soup, you know? Soup here and there. Help me out. We've never seen this many before. I know. Set. I don't know where they're coming from, to be honest with you. Not that much ink around. Well, apart from the actual lake of ink, but don't worry about that. I won't talk about that if you won't talk. Are you going to stop? You have to do something? We actually have to keep fighting, or am I supposed to figure out what to do? It's one of those things where you, you're never quite sure, are right? you? could go on forever. Go in here and see if we can find a way out. Let's try. Yeah, it was worth it. We open this door. Helmets are definitely important. I'm guessing their heads are also important. Which confirms the theory that we've been working on for a long time. Gives me something to say whilst we just attack infinite 
these jokers. I also see that there's light behind that particular tunnel. Can we get in here? Oh. Just tell me to just find a new exit. I have to, I'm sure I have to make an exit, I just don't know how. Ooh, this is hurting. It stopped. The noise has stopped. I think that's all of them. Oh, okay, we, we did just have to keep fighting. Crawl out of next. You can open Probably this door. Just if we stay together from now on. Henry? Think you can lead the way? My best. Do my best. Seems like there's a lot more game than I was expecting it to be. I mean we've only played for four hours so far. So. Henry! Goodbye! We've been here. <laughs> this has happened before. I'm in the ink again. You know how you said not to? It's inside the vault. Okay. I'm okay. <clears throat> okay. Not that you asked. Where's my axe, please? There somewhere, probably. Okay, I'm creeped out again, actually. Because we're back in this place. And there's bendy things. And... It's gonna pick a boomy. <laughs> I'm gonna go. Ah. Well, it says it's a pilot. This is there. But the final reel might just be the name of the thing. So we've got a cross pipe, straight pipe, bend pipe, T pipe. We can make pipes. If we can find ink. There's a. Curious. I didn't mean to open this. Um, curious presence of a toilet to hide in. Which implies something to hide from. Yeah, that's interesting. Interesting. Okay, so give me some ink and I will do it. Gent. Hello, Boris Toy. That is a big piece of lore right there. Glad we found that. Very interesting. Not allowed. To, oh, right. Okay, it's full of ink. That's why. <laughs> so now we're gonna have to hide from things for a while, in order to make them drop ink. <laughs> That's my guess. Because <clears throat> otherwise, where are we gonna get the ink from to make that work? Right. We need. One straight, one bend, one T. Hearing noises. Not a fan of. I'm gonna have to figure out how to get some ink. Can we go in here now? Is this open? Yeah, because it's that sort of game. Another Hi, Bendy. Day, another dollar. You know, it's nice to see Bendy <laughs> once in a while. going there. You know, the good old days when it was just this thing appearing in weird places creeping me out. Now I'm actually running from danger and stuff like that. It's like, game's changed. Ain't what it used to be. Hearing sounds. Don't worry. <laughs> Remember when I was just picking up beans at uh, bacon soup and going, what's this? Could I pick all these up? A small memo to all administration offices. That was the time. Who said those were the days, but we said we can't <laughs> it's only three hours. The idea that the company is in some form of financial difficulty is untrue. And the slanderous lie against us. It's also been known to me that some backroom incompetence are not trusting my leadership. 
As a leader, I'm always steering the boat, guiding our destiny, looking at the big picture. No need for you people to worry about such complicated things. Just do whatever it is you do and trust your leader, which is me. Wasted. Um, it's kind of a nice that that thing, at least one of them, is patrolling. I have nothing with which to distract or attack it. Now I have to hide from it. Oh, crap. How did you not see me, you loser? Um... I mean, having played games like Duke Nukem and Max Payne, I know exactly what that's for. I'm gonna turn around. I go through here. I mean, the room, so I can hide. I don't know if opening the doors gives them a new way of going. Or what? It's need some ink, dudes. What are you hiding from me for? A wall? Here ends the passage. So dark all of a sudden. What? Nothing special. Not so dark. Well, I guess it's kind of dark looking through that thing. I'm going to assume that's the effect of that thing. There. That makes me feel a lot better. <laughs> don't know their paths. I don't know where they are. Apart from right there, apparently. I'm going to stay here for a while and hope that it, it passes me by without looking into it. Haha, ha, you fool. Not these guys again. I better stay out of sight. Why do you just sort of shite, sir? Ah, lame. Can't hit him with that, huh? <laughs> okay, fine. That was a bit rude. It's not like I wasn't peeping around the corner or anything. Oh, that scared me. Probably start outside administration. Back in the vault. Wowie. Fine. I assume I can run back to here. If I need to. But that's a little bit far when I'm about to get attacked. And um, I was trapped between the two of them. Ah! Already! Bendy saved me. Just gives up. What a loser. What a freaking weirdo. How many times do I have to kill them, huh? I did say at the time when Alice made me kill them, it was like, I killed these guys already, so what are you up to? So slow. That's the trouble. Freaks. <laughs> what is this background clicking? Are you hearing it? Anyway, like I was saying, obviously when you've played games like Max Payne, you know full well when there's a crack in the wall, you can explode the wall. Literally what it's I wish there was a map. <laughs> By me. Aha. Not smart enough to see me. 
It's lucky because I'm so scared that I'm going quiet again. And you guys are screwed up. There's another one coming around the corner, I'm pretty sure of it. Corner. Oh, ah! Get out of here. Ah, oh, feck. Leave me alone. Hey, it left me alone. But not for long, okay. <laughs> I need to find a hiding place. There's one up here. One in here. I'm running. Go running. This way. This way. Don't be one here. Okay, good. Get in it! Get in it! I mean, I make myself scared. That's the trouble. There's no need to worry, because all I'm going to do is respawn nearby anyway. How many times can I possibly be brought? The ink is bringing me back! You know, these, these things think they want me dead, but they don't, because their master, the ink, is... The very thing that is respawning me each time. Okay, so there's that creepy bendy that we saw. Heck, I don't know. We're going in and out of rooms. Half expecting to find maybe. Something for this to show me. Missing pipes everywhere. We should learn something about the ink. Oh god, they can't see me. Guess we'll go back and listen to that. <laughs> I thought you couldn't see me through the thing. That's the whole point of the thing. Why do you have to take so long getting in there? It's really... Ex <laughs> I don't know what I'm looking for here. And we're coming to the end of the episode, which is... Ooh, stressful. I didn't see a, a clocking machine, did you? ka -ching. Save it. be good. Learned a lot about the ink machine. Just from one audio log as well, which is great. That's all it takes, just one little tidbit of information. So the ink machine, as we've learned, was originally... Oh, there's one there. Was originally intended to produce these figurines. But, according to the creator of the ink machine itself, first Bendy figurine came out weird. Joey Drew kept pressing to make it more and more magic and less and less just simple. And something about running it through using the cartoon cells to do something with it? You know? It, it, what? <laughs> and then obviously the Bendy that we keep encountering is the first one of that run. That first run that they're talking about, but what? <laughs> you know? How? There's, there's still a, a big gap missing in our understanding of what could possibly have happened. Um, but the ink machine basically became so ludicrously complicated that it transcended normal reality and became a sort of a parody of itself. A parody of true reality. So back to see me. Yeah. I got to clean some of the offices around 2 a.m. last night. I feel like I've read this. Heard this. Heard this? A big freaking chocolate cake. Just Apart from literally just now. Practically yell at my name. You know, I work hard. I earn my pay. Every darn dollar. But you know what this company's missing? Little benefit and points. And this here cake? It's a point. Yeah, 
we have, because I remember they spelt no one wrong. The last time I saw it. Please don't see me through the door. That would have been hard to get past. Although you can just leg it past it. <laughs> it do take a second or two to react and run straight past him. There are some doors not yet opened. Would be my task. Who's Chen? Is he talking about these things? Like literally the ones that we're avoiding right now. Or some other grinning thing. <laughs> it's pretty obvious you can't open those doors because it's been consistent so far that only the ones with windows open. But I'm expecting at some point one of the ones without windows will open. Therefore will get me something. Plenty of hidey holes. Also, there were just fewer vents because I'm trying to hide from these jokers. They keep seeing me through the walls. There's nothing written on the walls in the special way. Sweet nothings are not being whispered to me by a, a benevolent force. But even the person who has the benevolent force around her head doesn't know what they're for. Good look at these dudes through. Keep going, you weird, gross noisy people. Ugh. I know they've been going a long time. Bit of a longer episode than usual. I thought that was coming off of him. I was like, I'm a genius. But no, it was just a blob of light in the air. There's one more unopened office. There's got to be something there. There's more in it. What is the map to this place? Does it even have a shape? Yikes. <laughs> can't get in the office close enough to uh. oh, and the fact I've got the window open is actually making me so chilly that it's adding to my fear Interesting. Okay, good. keep going gonna work through this you and me We have to get to the office of Joey Drew, obviously. We saw that before, but we were running away. I remember. Hi, Bendy. Mate, Bendy, you are a sight for sore eyes these days. Play that for free. Hey. I know how much That's the intro. Shake their hand, spend an afternoon with them, love them. Susie, I'll be straight with you. I'm putting together a small project. A little 
so it's probably time to save this game and come off. But I can't get to a save point just yet. I believe that I'm going to have to carry this all the way back now. <laughs> it doesn't make me full of confidence, but that's okay. Yee! Yeah, just kite all three of them. What's the worst that could happen? I assume it's still following me. I'm not entirely sure. I also assume that I can uh, climb in the door, <laughs> climb in the, the toilet with ink in my hand and not lose it. Because I'd like to keep the ink, please. I assume I would respawn without it. So we know what we have to do. We have to do that like three times, which is absurd. Oh, damn it. Did you see him go, damn it? That face. Please let me keep that ink. If not, next episode, we know what we're doing. Okay, good. We still know what we're doing next episode. But for now, we're going to make a straight pipe. Well, we'll see if anything changes. If anything changes, we know that the next episode is going to be interesting. I think it might change because... Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Luckily, Bendy can't see inside toilets. Um, uh, the fact that I'm going to redirect the ink implies to me that the... Some of the offices had ink pipes in them, so I'm guessing that the position of the next lump of ink is going to change when I do this. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. It's been a little bit slow and creep about you, but it's also been mildly terrifying, and I am freezing cold. So I'm going to uh, go to bed, save this here. Thank you for watching. I hope that you'll join me in the next episode. I hope you'll leave me some feedback, and uh, until next time, I guess I'll see you.